Hey guys, welcome back. It's Brick25. We're back in another video, and for today's video, as you can see by the title, I'm going to be doing a Lego unboxing. Uh, so as you can tell, this one's obviously from Amazon, and then this one right here is from the Lego store. I actually ordered this one about a week ago, and at the time there was some offers, so I'm going to show you guys what I got with those offers, and yeah. So when I make unboxing videos, I like to start with the smaller stuff first, then make my way up to the bigger one. So first we're going to start with this one, then we're going to move on to the bigger box. But just before we get into the boxes, I just want to include this. Um, I didn't really order it online, however I did buy it in store and I just kind of want to include it just because I'm showing you like sets I bought. Um, but the first like set that I got is this Lego City Holiday Camper Van, it's set number 60283. Um, so now that the first set is out of the way, let's get into the first package. So the second set in this unboxing is this Lego Ninjago Zane's Power Up Mech Evo. It's set number 71761 and I just thought it was a pretty cool set. I don't really get Lego Ninjago stuff, but I just thought I'd get it. Um, the minifigures are pretty cool. Um, not like your regular minifigures. So yeah, the Lego Ninjago set was the only thing I ordered in Amazon. Uh, but now we're going to be moving on to the Lego store box. And I'm really excited because at the time of purchasing this, I got two offers. It was double VIP point week. And also if you were to spend $140 or more, you get a free set. So that free set's inside of this box. And I'm pretty excited. The only thing I realized about when I got this set um, last week was it seems a little bit open. I don't think that's the case, but um, the tape seems peeled on each side and that's just how I got it. So hopefully everything's inside and let's open it up and show you guys what I got. So there is quite a few stuff inside of this purchase. So I'm really excited. Um, and yeah, let's just get straight into it. So I'm gonna pull this out of the way. Um, yeah, so as you can see, first we're going to start off with some smaller stuff. So we'll start with this. Um, and it looks like it's the Minecraft one. I don't really order a lot of Minecraft, but I decided to get this set just because it was pretty cool. And I think it was on sale, so I decided why not. It's the Creeper Ambush. It's set number 2177. Um, sorry, 21177. It's a pretty cool set. Uh, you got like Steve, you got like a Creeper, and then you get like a pig and a chicken, which is pretty cool. Um, and in the back, you can kind of see the set a lot better. So yeah, I decided to get this. It has 72 pieces. And so moving on to the fourth set, I have this Lego Marvel Eternals. It's set number 76145. It's the Eternals Aerial Assault. It has 133 pieces. A uh, pretty cool set. And I never really got a Lego Eternals. I never heard of it until I saw it. So I'm like, why not get it? It looks like some superhero stuff, which is pretty cool. And yeah. So yeah, I moved the box, but moving on to our fifth set is this pretty cool set. It's called the Lego City Bathtub Stunt Bike. Um, I just thought it was pretty neat and pretty funny. Uh, you get a rubber ducky and it's like a motorcycle, but it's a bathtub. Uh, pretty cool. I've seen these Lego stunts around and I decided to get one. Um, it has 14 pieces. It's set number 60333 and it's suggested for ages 5 and up. And if you go on the back, as you can see, you can kind of like pull the wheel back and it kind of drives forward, which is pretty neat. And yeah. So moving on to the sixth set, I got this Lego Statue of Liberty. It's Brickheads, set number 40367. It has 153 pieces and it's suggested for ages 10 and up. So moving on to the seventh set, I actually got another Brickhead set. This is the Lego Toy Story. Buzz Layer, it's set number 40552, has 114 pieces, and it's suggested for ages 10 and up. So moving on to the 8th set, I got this Lego City minifigure pack. This includes three minifigures and this little um, scooter charging station, I guess you can say, with like a solar panel here. Uh, pretty cool, and if we move on the back, it says there's an exclusive minifigure included, so that's pretty neat. So moving on to the 8th Lego set, I got another Brickhead set. Uh, there is quite a bit of Brickhead set in this um, unboxing, I must say. Um, but this is the Lego Pets Poodle Bundle. Um, so you get the Puppy uh, Poodle and you also get the adult version of the Poodle. This is set number 40546. It has a 304 pieces and it's suggested for ages 8 and up. So moving on to the ninth one, we got another Brickhead set. This is the Pets French Bulldogs. It has the puppy version of a French Bulldog and then the adult version. This is set number 40544. It has 237 pieces and it's also suggested for ages 8 and up. So I just realized I made a mistake. The last Lego set was actually number 10. So now we're moving on to number 11. And I got another Lego Brickhead set. 
This is the Lego Goldfish Bundle. It's set number 40442 and has 186 pieces and it's also just suggested for ages 8 and on. So moving on to the 12th Lego set, another brick head set, but I can confirm this is the last brick head set in this unboxing. This is set number 40466 and this is sort of the Panda Bundle. Um, instead of two, there's actually three brick heads in this set, so that's pretty cool. It has 249 pieces and it's suggested for just 10 and up. So moving on to the 13th set, this is actually the free set they give you when you purchase something over $140. This is the Lego City 4x4 Off-Road Ambulance Rescue, and it includes three minifigures. It's set number 40582, it has 162 pieces, and it's suggested for ages 6 and up. So moving on here, I have the Lego Wall Hanger set. It's set number 4016 has these three Lego studs, which looked pretty cool. And I think it's gonna look nice in the Lego room. Um, I've done quite a bit to the Lego room since I last made a Lego update, um, but I will be making one soon maybe. Comment down below if you guys wanna see that soon. And yeah. So moving on, I have this Lego VIP 1958 logo keychain, and I redeemed this for 950 points. So I'm really excited to see what's inside. So I'm gonna be opening it right now. Um, I haven't seen it yet. I have seen the pictures, but I haven't really seen it in person. And I thought it was pretty cool and I had enough points. I thought I'd get it. And as you can see, it's right there. It says Lego systems. Let me just flip this. It says Lego systems. And this also kind of like spins. So that's pretty cool. And yeah. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Hopefully you enjoyed this Lego unboxing. Um, and comment down below which set you guys wanted to see me build in my next week's video on Wednesday. Uh, we got a lot of great sets. So comment down below which one you guys want me to build. And I'll probably build it. And yeah, so again, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye.